Hey guys, welcome to a new week of The Rundown. On this episode, CMP released the mpt and &E Strategic Design, the Senior Enlisted Academy is streamlining its training, and updates to Navy Cool. Chief Naval Personnel Vice Admiral Robert Burke has released the mpt and &E Strategic Design to provide insight on the Navy's efforts to recruit and retain the best and brightest sailors. The design provides CMP's five guiding principles and three lines of efforts for meeting the needs of the Navy, its sailors, and their families. Commands are encouraged to print and post the design throughout their workspaces. You can find the design on the NPC homepage and under references on CMP's page on navy.mil slash CMP. The Senior Enlisted Academy would decrease the length of its training courses from 13 to 11 weeks to provide more flexibility and opportunities for qualified sailors to attend. The change will add one SEA class per year while decreasing class size. The new schedule will consist of seven weeks of distant learning and three weeks of in-residence training, a total of nine classes per year. SEA graduation is a prerequisite for sailors to promote to Master Chief. Find more information in NAV Admin 109-17 and read our story on Navy.mil. Finally, Navy Cool has reduced the remaining time and service requirement for sailors from 12 months down to 6 months for pursuing civilian licensing opportunities. This means that sailors closer to the end of their contract cannot pursue civilian licensing through Navy Cool. Another update will allow sailors to pursue credentialing based on their education, even if their degree does not align with their military occupation. Read details in the story on Navy.mil and visit the Navy Cool website at cool.navy.mil. Well, that's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople.fct and navy.mil. For the Chief Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching. <laughs>